Forget the chase. Master the art of attraction. Be irresistible, not desperate. In the exhilarating journey of early dating, there's a common pitfall many of us stumble into, the relentless pursuit of someone we find incredibly captivating. It's a scenario where the desire to turn a spark into something enduring often leads us to a critical mistake. The more we yearn for that person who might seem a bit out of reach or whose feelings about us remain uncertain, the more we risk losing sight of the crucial elements that define our lives, our friends, family, hobbies, and the sources of our identity. The Allure of Trying Harder The instinct to try harder when enamored with someone is paradoxical. Contrary to intuition, investing excessive effort doesn't necessarily make the other person more attracted to us. In fact, it might have the opposite effect, creating distance and allowing them to feel in control of the situation. This misguided approach often intensifies anxiety and leads us further away from the aspects of life that truly matter. Consider the tale of David Mustin, ousted from Metallica, who went on to form the wildly successful band Megadeth. Despite his achievements, he couldn't escape the shadow of his former band's colossal success. This narrative is juxtaposed with the story of Pete Best, ousted from the Beatles, who found happiness in a life filled with love, family, and contentment. The key difference? They valued different things. Learning to value the right things. In the pursuit of lasting happiness, it's crucial to learn to value the right things. When the prospect of finding a life partner becomes all-encompassing, and we meet someone who appears to embody our dreams, we often neglect the vital components of our lives. It's counterintuitive, but the solution lies in doubling down on the elements that give us a sense of worth outside of a romantic relationship. Legs under the table, building FU confidence. Imagine your confidence as a tabletop, supported by sturdy legs representing different facets of your life, your hobbies, passions, friends, family, and purpose. These pillars provide strength, meaning, and love. When encountering someone special, it's crucial that these legs are already robust. The worst thing to do is either lack these pillars or suddenly dismiss their importance because of a newfound romantic interest. Building FU confidence involves investing deeply in the areas of life that bring meaning and perspective. This not only enlarges your life beyond the romantic sphere but also positions you as an equal in any relationship. If things don't work out, you stand tall, knowing you have a rich, fulfilling life to fall back on. Don't let the new relationship diminish you. Meeting someone attractive who also holds the promise of being a significant addition to your life is undeniably thrilling. However, the counterintuitive move is to continue investing in the various aspects of your life that provide FU confidence. Even if this person is impressive, it doesn't diminish the importance of who you are and what you bring to the table. Invest in yourself. The ultimate reality check. As we navigate the complexities of dating, the ultimate reality check lies in investing in ourselves. It's more than a realization prompted by a video, it's about training the muscles in our lives. Warren Buffett's wisdom rings true, the greatest investment is in oneself. People may come and go, but the dividends from self-investment last a lifetime. Remember, real confidence isn't just about saying no to what you don't want, it's about saying no to things you do want when they're not right for you. So, invest in yourself, cultivate that FU confidence, and watch as the world takes notice of the irresistible, self-assured individual you've become. Hi. I am Sarah.